We're going to give this a go. <sighs> Let's see if we can get this working. Oh. Nice. I don't even know. What's wrong with TikTok? Your fans break it. I know. It's true. They do. Fred, guys. I mean, they're wonderful, and this is great. But okay, <laughs> before anything disappears, let's go back to the story that we were... For those of you who are just joining in, like, what is happening? I'm sitting down right now with William White, who is uh, People Magazine's sexiest TikTok star, um, but also a Canadian guy who has now become... Uh, a model and we were just talking about some of the great campaigns that you've worked with yeah. um, over on TikTok but we were just about to talk about your Los Angeles experience you met a lot of really great people so so talk about some of those people and how they inspired you when you were there yeah so I met Addison Reyes you guys know who that is um Paris Hilton's mom what's her name again sorry Kathy, Kathy. I always get to mix up Cassie or Kathy 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 Hilton I met um Michael Jackson's daughter was really cool just because we clicked like right away. So mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, Addison Ray has a boyfriend. So that's, that was a picture. No Addison Ray. Yeah. No, it's okay. Sure. it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You're good. It'll be another. Okay. okay, good. Um, but yeah, and it was just so, oh yeah. And then Madonna comes up and me and Kelly were just losing our minds that Madonna was there. Really? And, Did you talk yeah. to Madonna? No. She, but she was such like I'd be scared to talk to her. Like she's very like hardcore, but yeah. But pretty amazing. No, you were in a really incredible group of people raising a lot of money, and your fans raised a lot of money that night. Can you talk a little bit about that? Yeah. So, uh, Amphar is for AIDS, and my fans raised I think it was twenty thousand dollars, and like it was pretty last minute notice, so yeah. they're right on that. And uh, I want to thank my fans for that. Thank you so much. Yeah. Speaking of your fans, they are, they are really, we were talking about it earlier, a really powerful group of people. They voted 5 million times to get you voted as people's sexiest TikTok star, which is incredible. What do you have to say to your fans? Uh, this ride's been a very quick one for you, but, but really yeah. incredible. Yeah, I just want to say thank you so much. Keep doing what you guys are doing. Keep making those edits. Keep getting me out there. So appreciated. Also, you guys don't have to send me anything. I know they send me a lot of gifts, like presents and stuff, but you guys don't have to do that. Um, but it's appreciated. Uh, but yeah, just thank you so much. Keep doing what you guys are doing. Let's keep doing, uh, making a positive impact on this world. And uh, yeah, that's about it. I like that. And as for your career, where do you want to see this go, William? I know that, you know, we saw you out in the truck with your dad and you were working really hard the last couple of days. And that's an important part of who you are. But in terms of modeling and acting, where do you want to take this? Yeah, like I want to be um, like a model. I want to be a big model, big actor one day. Mm -hmm. Hopefully start in like a movie, you know. So I'm starting to do acting classes and get into that hopefully by like next year a couple of years even get in my first film you know that's great yeah and who is your yeah. dream co-star dream co-star like uh okay if it was an action flick who okay. would be like your dream to be in an action flick with and then i'll say if it was a rom-com like a romantic comedy who's your dream so let's go with like an action flick if it was an action flick who would your dream be like leonardo dicaprio maybe Good one. Yeah. Good one. Dwayne The Rock Johnson would also be really good. Oh, yeah. I could be like a sidekick kind of guy. He's a big boy. I could be like the sidekick. <laughs> hey, that's, that's a good one. All right. What about a rom-com, romantic comedy? Who would be your favorite? Ooh. Um, maybe like me and Jennifer Aniston, like having a thing or something. You've mentioned <laughs> Jennifer Aniston a couple of times now, I think. I think, I think. Yeah, I think she's cute. Yeah, she's a pretty amazing lady, for sure. Um, what does your family think of this? I mean, I think probably when this all started, it was wondering how long this would last. Um, mm -hmm. But this is lasting. This is continuing to grow. You're making a really big career for yourself. Um, what does your family think? They're very proud. I think they're going through a little bit of their own, like, 
whoa, now we got a little bit of the world looking at us. You know, we got to be on our A game. Yeah. But it's good. It's good for them. Like, and yeah, um, it's really good because it's putting our family together again. My parents were separated. Now they're realizing we got to be there for the family. They see like all the struggle and anxiety I'm going through. So they're really there for me. It's so, uh, yeah. That's beautiful. I mean, that's good. Bringing the family together, right? You talk about mental health. It's such an important part. I mean, really for everyone, this last two years has been really intense. You've been going through that along with everybody else. But on top of that, you, eyes on you have have grown immensely how are you handling your mental health and what are you doing to stay healthy stay healthy go for runs work out read do something talk to yourself you know don't get too in your head yeah um and yeah don't yeah don't party too much because i will <laughs> that is always a good one william just like yeah. You, yeah, keep it under control, right? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, definitely. I think taking care of yourself is is the number one thing as you go through all of this, which is really, really exciting. Well, congratulations on all your success. We're excited to see what is next. Can you even, t whenever I ask someone, if a celebrity, like, what's next, they usually can't say, but is there a nugget that you can give fans about what is next for you? Mm, oh, no. no. I'm gonna, I'm just, I know, I know. Yeah, just wait for the surprise. You know, it's going to be some good things are happening. I'm going to go to LA soon. I'm going to go to Paris soon. And then I'll take my fans with me. And yeah. And that'll be that. I know. See, guys, I tried to ask, um, but it's just, I, I've asked that question before and they can never say. So, so there it is. Um, someone said Paris question mark. So I guess, why are you going to Paris? I can't say yet. Can't say yet. All right. All right, guys. Well, then I can't. We're just going to have to stop it here. That's just the end of it. Are you ready for the holidays? How about that? Can I ask that? Yeah, I am. Well, I got to go Christmas shopping still for the family. You haven't um, started yet? No, have you? I'm done. <laughs> no, you're not. Yes, I am. I am finished. Jesus. Okay. Yeah, you need to get on it. We need to, we need, you need to get yeah. on that Christmas shopping for sure. I'm going to bring my mom shopping this weekend. Nice. Going to get her to pick out her favorite purse. So that'll be good. that yeah. is a very nice thing to do. That's fantastic. All right. Well, you be well. And um, thanks for sticking with us. And we will, you'll see the story uh, of William on December 2nd on AT Canada. Thank you, Show, for having me. Okay. You be well. Yeah. Okay. Take care. Bye, everyone. Bye,